Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix a Gmail session expired. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. In this case, whenever you're accessing Gmail here by default, whenever you access it again, typically it's just going to refresh itself. But sometimes users would actually experience the Gmail session expired error which is something really confusing and actually frustrating to fix. But in this case, I'll be showing you some things that you can do here to probably fix this issue. So one of those things is to just basically reload your page here. Typically, whenever you reload your page, it's going to uh, fix some of the details here or uh, settings or uh, things that you see here on Gmail. Now, typically when you reload that, it's going to refresh everything and that should solve some of the issues. But if that doesn't solve the issue, well, the next thing that you want to do here is you just want to basically close the browser itself and basically restarting it. Now, sometimes play, uh, restarting your browser here can solve a lot of issues. But again, closing the browser itself might not work because sometimes there are going to be like settings or cookies that needs to be cleared. In this case, at the top right of your screen, go ahead and click on the G dotted icon. And from here, what you need to do is you need to go to settings. Now, from here, what we need to do is we need to go to the option here that says privacy and security. Now, from here, what we need to do is you need to look for third party cookies, click on it, scroll down a bit. And from here, you need to go to the option that says see all site data and permissions. Now from here, what we need to do is you just need to click on the delete all data section here. Now, just warning here, it will actually clear your cookies here. Like for example, if a website that you're using actually use cookies, that would actually clear that out. Now in this case, if you don't want to do that, you need to manually search for Gmail or Google here. Now typically you could just uh, basically type it in here or just type in Google. Now from here, what you need to do is you just need to basically clear it. But again, it is recommended that you click on the delete all data here. And also another thing that you could do here is you want to actually go to clear browsing history here because sometimes having a lot of history on your browser here can affect your browsing experience. In this case, go ahead and choose the time range here. So you have an hour, 24 hours, seven days, or four weeks. In this case, once you've done that, you can go ahead and click on clear data. Now, in this case, uh, see if that actually solves your issue. Now, if that doesn't solve the issue, now the final thing that we could do here is to check any updates on your browser. Go to about Chrome here if you're using Google Chrome, and it's going to automatically update itself. Also, another thing, this is just a small detail that you should check here, is to make sure that your time on your computer is actually correct. Sometimes websites would actually cross-check the time itself, especially if you manually set the time on your computer. So you need to actually have it on the correct time itself. So in this case, change it and make sure that it's actually updated. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you. Like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.